Hi there, welcome to another Playful Learning at Home video. My name is Chase. My name is Ryan. And, and we're from the Discovery Center Museum in Rockford, Illinois. Today we're going to be doing a little experiment about buoyancy. So all we have today is some aluminum foil. We have, we have marbles, but you can use beads, you can use coins, whatever small weights you have at home. And we're using a big bucket of water. You can use, if you have a bucket like this, you can use that. You can use your bath for the bath time, whatever you have with your parents' permission. So we're going to do, Mr. Ryan, we're going to make boats. A boat. A boat. Out of our aluminum foil. All you have to do is start folding it in. But the thing you have to keep in mind is we need some sort of bowl shape. The way a boat floats is that it has air inside of it. So some sort of bowl shape to keep air inside of it. Because air is lighter than water. All right. Go for it, Mr. Ryan. I think my boat's ready to go. Very nice. All right, so our boats are now floating in the water, and what we're going to do is we're going to start dropping beads to them, see how many beads we can hold inside of our boats. All right, all right. One, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, they're both still up. Eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh, there goes uh, mine. So, what 14, was wrong with mine, Mr. 15. Chase? Yours, I think the edges were letting in some water. I folded up my edges to keep the water out. But actually, now I've got fifteen. Mine's only a couple away. Let's see if we can hold one, two, three, four, five. Now, at twenty, we're still good. Yeah. I want you folks to take pictures of your own boats that you make and post them to hashtag Discovery Center. Uh, that's all we have for today. If you folks could subscribe to our channel for more daily videos and look for more information on our Playful Learning at Home webpage. Thank you. Subscribe for more daily science, crafts, and activities. Or visit the Discovery Center Museum Playful Learning at Home webpage for more information.